In a distant future, humans Ooh. and demons live together in a desertic world deprived of water, Sandland. To restore the balance to the world, Sandland. The theme Prince Beelzebub forms Ooh, a. Ooh, look at the animation! That looks so sick. Wait, I want to see them in the car again. It looks so sick. Ah, oh, this is so cool. Fiend Prince Beelzebub forms a strange trio with his chaperone demon thief and the human sheriff Raoul. Together, they will set off on an epic journey in search of the legendary spring. Sandland is an action RPG Japanese manga series that was created and illustrated by Akira Toriyama. Akira Toriyama notably created Dragon Ball as well, and you can definitely see it in the vibe of this game. If you're wondering what this is moving behind me, it's just our cat, BB. This Welcome is to Sandland, sick. an immersive and exciting action RPG based on the manga by Akira Toriyama, the creator of Dragon Ball. The creator of Dragon Ball? In this overview of Sandland's gameplay, Let's go. you will discover its environments, gameplay systems, and unique elements that will make your adventure unique and memorable. Sandland is described as nostalgic and heartwarming, where you play as a character called Beezlebub. Is that how you say it? Beezlebub? As you play, you can unlock a variety of different tanks and other vehicles that you can upgrade and level up as you play to adapt to your own play style and preferences. This includes battle tanks with powerful cannons, motorbikes that speed through deserts, and jump bots that bounce over rivers to explore every corner of the continent, and that's what it says on Steam. Yeah, literally Dragon Ball In vibes! Sandland, you play as Beelzebub, Fiend Prince. It's Beelzebub. I said that completely wrong. Be I said Beezlebob. Did I say Beezlebob? Ah, Beelzebub. In every step of Dude. your adventure, you will be accompanied by <gasps> Thief centaur. and Rao, who will support you in and out of combat with unique skills, as well as advises during your travel. Did the demon village always used to be where it is now? Oh yeah, it's Be Beels know, there is no record of Beelzebub. <laughs> Staying in one spot for so long is a sign of good governance. The long lasting desert oh, look his tail. is yours to encounter unique creatures. <gasps> Why can I not say Meet that? The mysterious Anne, but beware of a challenge that awaits. The king's royal army, commanded by the supreme commander Zeu, is coming. Beyond Sandland oh, lies a world, populated by even more unique and dangerous enemies. Be ready to advance in this adventure. I love that you can explore different worlds that aren't just Sandland in this game as well, and I love the character designs. They are so stunning, and also the different animals. They're so creative. I love them. Epic. Careful, your first fight is coming. Fists up. Level 24 and its first fight. In combat, Beelzebub nice. is a ferocious fighter that has access to light and heavy attacks, oh, sweet. which can be chained both on the ground as well as in the air. Oh, I like the different attacks that you get like straight Don't forget to off dodge in the game. In midair and sideways. Sometimes it looks really get closer satisfying. to the enemy silently and <gasps> wow. as you progress in your Help. journey, you will gain points that can be spent to unlock Beelzebub's skills. Is it co-op? I'm will not be able sure. To power up special skills such as the ability to turn your body to metal, or even oh, dark sweet. release. Let's find out. That hurt, you <laughs> Don't forget that even the strongest fiend needs a power up, so manage your supplies. Consumable items can increase your attacks, defense, and help you recover power of darkness. So Ooh, make sure to stock the up. The power of darkness looks so cool. Also, Water is an important resource that you can restock in water supply points. Always stay hydrated. And will be consumed to heal your health in case you are about to be defeated. I'd love to understand a little bit more what the power of darkness is. So if you know what it is, please let me know in the comments. All vehicles in Sandland have unique features. I guess they all need to be sand friendly. The jump ah. bot will bounce over high cliffs. I love that you can pick the hover though. car can float over water to cross dangerous rivers. Can you and use the all of them? Can move heavy obstacles to open blocked paths. Oh, that's so cool! Remember, you can carry up to five capsules, each containing a vehicle at any given time. So oh, plan that's ahead so according sick! To the situation and play style. Wait, that's so sick, guys. You can carry around five of them and just pick and choose. Vehicles will not only increase obsessed. the agility while exploring, but will also prove to be very useful in battles. Kenshin tinted glasses. With higher firepower, mobility, <laughs> and resistance, though. vehicles can stand up against huge enemies and tank groups Shaq, that you know Beelzebub it. alone struggles to defeat. And things like that. I'm Anne, and it's your lucky Hills. day. 
I happen to be Wait, are they called pills? Here. Is that what they were called? Your new ally, Anne, will help you to build, Anything? upgrade, and equip your vehicles. Vehicles can be equipped oh. with powerful and different weapons, such as rocket launchers, lasers, machine guns, and shotguns. Oh, sweet. So you can be sure to always have the right tool for the occasion. You know it. Weapons are not the only part of the vehicles that you can customize. Engines and suspensions will affect driving and boosting performance, while option parts will unlock special performances. But they actually called pills. To Why can I not re to remember what they were called? <laughs> Does you like? Pay a visit to the paint shop to Is color it? it the way it reflects your style. And don't forget decals. I feel like customization in games like this is really important and like what they said in the gameplay trailer as well it does create that unique experience per player which I am obsessed oh, with. Oh I like this one! It's like a space hopper sort of vibe. That's fun. It looks kind of... Mm, Another I was gonna say it looks quite difficult but I don't think it's that difficult. Is to unlock skill trees for your friends. Ah, oh, cute! Rao will temporarily support you during fights by riding on the tank and attacking enemies. Whoa. While Thief's talents will be evident outside of combats as he helps you get additional items or hunt for rarer loot. How quick is it to change in and out of the pills? Anne also has <laughs> access to her unique skill tree, which will focus on making your vehicles more efficient and powerful. I know we're on this adventure with different characters, so I'd be really intrigued to know if you can play with other people in co-op as those characters as well. But I also think that it's really fun that you can discover which characters are best at different things and using different types of the During transport. During your quest, you will need a place to call home. <gasps> Even though it may look ravaged and decayed, Spino is the perfect place to set up camp. It has a garage Stunning. to build and upgrade your vehicles, as well as merchants to purchase items from. Can you at the back upgrade of the garage, stuff at the base? Create or? the ideal room that can be extended up to three times the original size. Oh, cute! So we just and get like one room in this whole base. That's a bit crazy because the base is like massive. I guess just having a room that you can decorate is fun. Arranged with a wide selection of furniture, including Ooh. walls, ceilings, and vehicles. Whether Put your vehicles in, modern, in there as well. Hideout, woods, or cyber style. Ooh. I like the wood style. That was my favorite. When starting out, Spino may not have many citizens, but it has the potential to grow. Furniture making. Sweet. So As you complete side quests, She's so recover cute. items, or defeat enemies, the town will evolve to the next stage, and you can purchase rare components, hire new services, and allow new opportunities for adventures. Oh, wait. Now that looks really built up. More adventures what? await you in the Sandland world. Oh, Join Mario to Kart test your vehicle who? speed. Wait, Try that's actually really fun. Try bounty hunt or battle arenas to put your strengths and abilities to the test against strong bosses. I guess it's sort of like training as well, isn't it? Oh my gosh, Step this guy's face! Ah. Your adventure is dictated by your bravery and imagination. I honestly love the look of this game, like the animations and the illustration are obviously stunning. And I really love that you can use different types of tanks, motorbikes and bots. I feel like it adds another element of strategy to your combat style as well. Being able to use different types of combat just keeps it fresh when you're playing a game. Obviously the game gives like Dragon Ball vibes because it was illustrated and created by Akira Toriyama. And I definitely want to give this one a go. So the game developers ILCA also created One Piece Odyssey and Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. And the game is coming out on the 25th of April, 2024. Don't forget to leave a like on this video and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Bye!